We move on now to banking reports. Now, with the strategic location in West Africa, major parts or uh, major ports like Lagos and Apapa, Nigeria is well positioned as a central hub for regional trade, and by leveraging these trade opportunities and addressing the associated challenges, the country can unlock the significant economic potential and achieve sustainable growth. President of the Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria, CIBN, Professor Biji Olawawaju said this at the 2024 Fellowship Investiture with a the theme, Maximizing the Potentials of the Nigerian Economy. Details now. Annually, the Chartered Institutes of Bankers of Nigeria, CIBN, hosts an event to bestow its prestigious fellowship status on members who have made exceptional contributions to the Institute, the organizations, the banking industry, and the broader economy. Hereby yeah, affirm that I will respect, promote and abide by the provisions of the Act. This year, the Institute is honoring 15 honorary fellows, 421 elected fellows, and 209 honorary senior members. In his opening remarks, the CIBN president, Professor Deji Olarinwaju, states that as professional bankers, they must collaborate with the government and other stakeholders to efficiently maximize the nation's potentials. While the chair of the occasion, Dr. Stella Okoli, says the theme is timely and works in consonance with the agenda of the current administration. We are expected you know, to collaborate with the government and other stakeholders to ensure that the potential of Nigeria are efficiently optimized. Ladies and gentlemen, Nigeria is a vibrant and dynamic nation which no doubt has the potential to transform itself into an economic powerhouse. This can be done in part, in part by emulating the sources, stories, and other developing countries which are followed in the same path. I think that the president and all members of cabinet, you know, will be very pleased that you're here. Thinking and, you know, uh, what can we do? How can we help Nigeria? How can we be great again? So, I don't know if there's a representative from Mr. President here. If not, please, I beg you that you should send the messages across. This is what we can do. This is what the banking does we can do. That's, you know, outcome of today's you know, event. President of the Nigerian Economic Society, Professor Adeola Adenikinju, is the guest speaker for this year, and he shares on maximizing the potentials of the Nigerian economy, policy options, challenges, and prospects. He notes that as global economic dynamics evolve, the Nigerian economy may face increased volatility and complexity. However, Adenikinju states that the outcomes will depend on the collective actions and inactions of professionals and the nation as a whole. So we must find a way of implementing policies to lower rise in inflation. And this policy must include not just monetary policies, but there must be an interface between the monetary and fiscal policies in the way that monetary policy tackles liquidity challenges, demand side challenges, whereas fiscal policies could to tackle supply side constraints. The CIB and president urges professional bankers and newly inducted members to relentlessly pursue excellence and maintain the highest ethical standards in their efforts to foster a thriving and prosperous Nigerian economy. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.